Good evening. Here are some of the headlines we're tracking today, 24th October 2022. This is tomorrow's news today. Court others final for future of Desiani's Abuja properties as well as cars. Atiku does not deserve reverse PDP vote, says Wike. Soludo cautions a number of communities against violence and bloodshed. NMA urges federal government to declare state of emergency in the health sector. Council lauds Buhari for action on Niger Delta Development Commission leadership. In business, telecoms contribute $70 billion to nation's economy, says NCC. Niger's biggest banks generate $57 billion from account maintenance fees and first half. In tech, Toyota to produce electric car powered by BYD batteries in China. Google sets up high-tech school at Israeli University. On the foreign scene, Rishi Sunak triumphs to become UK's new prime minister. Russia could plan dirty bomb pretext, Western countries say. Finally in spot, Middlesbrough named ex-Man United player Karik Boss. Thank you so much for listening. Make sure you get details of this and many more now and tomorrow on our website, guardian.ng. And do ensure to pick up a copy of the Guardian newspaper from Newsstands tomorrow. Not to forget, you can also connect with us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as YouTube at Guardian Nigeria. Have a good night and do stay safe.